Let's start for the second consecutive day with one of the huge stars in soccer, maybe the biggest, Cristiano Ronaldo. Yesterday, reports had him heading to Manchester City. But today, that deal died, and Manchester United stepped in and grabbed him up for a reported transfer fee of 25 million euro, which is about 30 million dollars. Ronaldo rose to stardom with Manchester United in the aughts. Frank, yep. how big a deal is his return? And you just mentioned it, Michael. This is where he started out, really. He went, you know, from Portugal then to Manchester United. That's where he made his mark. And I think, you know, I go back to when Kobe Bryant, there was talk about him maybe going to the Clippers. And you're thinking for his legacy and what that would mean to the fans, at the end of the day, he went back to the Lakers. And I think for Cristiano Ronaldo to go to Man City, that's the rival of Manchester United. And remember this name, Sir Alex Ferguson. That was his manager at Manchester United. There is a statue of Sir Alex in front of the stadium, Old Trafford, and at United. He called up Ronaldo, and Ronaldo has talked about him being a father to him. I think he knew, if I'm going back to play in the Premier League, and especially if I'm going to be, I'm going to be in Manchester, I can only play for one team, and it's Manchester United. Frank, I, I was, like, giddy at the size yeah. of this news you know, you wake up in the United States, you're already, you know, five or six hours behind, depending yep. on where you are here. And Sky Sports has special programming. I mean, <laughs> they have a special program. This, to me, is like Michael Jordan returning to the Bulls. Yeah. I mean, this is so unbelievably enormous in Europe. And it was interesting to just watch some of this coverage. And it started me wondering about some of the same questions they had. How much is nostalgia? And how significant a contribution can Ronaldo make at this point? But the notion of going to Manchester City was, was to quote one of their uh, analysts, torture <laughs> to Man U fans, yeah. where he's going to go back. Okay, how great is he? I mean, he's still a, a great goal scorer. He's going to play the number nine, the center forward there for Manchester United. And they need this shot in the arm because they finished no higher than second yeah. in the Premier League over the last, what, eight, nine seasons? And so it seems like just getting him has reinvigorated yes. the franchise, which, of course, is, I mean, you can compare it to the Yankees or the Canadians or the Celtics of, of Premier League action. And so people are just going crazy there at getting him back, even though he cannot be the same player possibly no. that he was in 2003, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, when he helped that franchise yeah. be on and top. And you're right, too. It's a short-term thing. It's only two years. Now, when he was there, they won three league championships and they won a Champions League. That's what Manchester United is trying to do. You look at Kylian Mbappe, the French player who went to Real Madrid. That's for today and the next 10 years. Ronaldo going back to Manchester United. It's about this moment. Manchester City, the crosstown rival, they have won everything the past couple of years in, in the English Premier League. Eclipse and just in, in that the last country. five. Exactly. Yeah. So they... I'll tell you what, it's a big blow to them because they wanted to get Harry Kane, they wanted to get Ronaldo, and he's back with the club where he wanted to be. I'm telling you, it would have been, it's just like when Kobe thought about the Clippers, but he's a Laker. In Manchester, Ronaldo, he's not a city player, he's a United player. He's, he's, he's back a United where he belongs. Player. Absolutely. Such, such a, just an enormous worldwide story. Yeah. Sky Sports, they were checking in with correspondents and coaches <laughs> all, all over the globe. It was and good. And it suddenly made me just say, no, I'm clicking off of preseason football for the yeah. rest of this weekend in this country, and I, I'm going to something that actually seems to mean yeah. something real. Real. Real games. Real you competition. Know, real cultural get, shift. Again. Get your agent on the phone. I could see you over there. You'll have a, <laughs> another gig. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.